Good morning and uh, welcome to our coverage of the Legends World Cup. We're here at the Central Broad Regional Park. A beautiful picture you can see out there as uh, they, in their team, they're coming up against uh, Pakistan when they're on the toss. And uh, they have decided to back first. And British Hotel, their captain, he said that, he said that it's a new pitch and it's new conditions for his players so they will just have uh, a sighter to see what it offers and of course uh, a man who knows a lot about this pitch is now joining me in the commentary position and that's my driver Henry uh, good morning Ivan how are you? I'm not too bad Vinod and I want to say thank you for um, bringing a presence so, so British is going to pick up the attack from the, the northern and here he is so the delivery to start with there, appeal, they're going to appeal, appeal, and appeal, you know, at this level. Out, so, from time to time we might see not only appeal, we might see runners in this game. Yes, this is a badly line and whipped away, one bounce into the boundary for four. So badly line on that occasion there by British Patel and all Akba Ali had to do was to help it around the corner and into the boundary for four. So good morning to... Rajesh Sharma, our oh, cameraman, and who was good enough to have played with the Kolkata Knight Riders in the opening stages of. This is driven away, down the pass, mid off, chase on there for the fielder, and he's going to pick it up just before the boundary. They're going to come back for two, Patel is calling for the ball, and uh, they get two more. Six without loss, I think that has brought us to the end of the first over. Of the 2021, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. this is Hoyt away. Beautiful shot by Barber. One bounce into the boundary for four, and uh, there was a a fielder place three quarters of the way uh, to the lawn boundary. So it's a very this time he drives. He could be out court. Yes, he is. And again, Singh. So Singh gets the wicket there off of Baba. Again, pitching up. Baba not having the strength or the timing to go over the long off boundary. And uh, the long off fielder made it look easy, very easy indeed. And uh, that's uh, a wicket. So it's now 13. The great Sir Isaac Vivian Alexander Richards. He could have done that with ease. This is quite a way, a beautiful shot this time. And that's four runs. And Ali Akbar. Uh, getting that one away into the boundary for four it's now seven, 21 for the loss of one and patel continues to bowl well and on for 13 that delivery though was not one of his best strike here's sod and that delivery swings in the air but it was badly nine to start with and it's into the boundary for four there's a youngster giving rapid chase but it beats him and goes over the line and uh, that is four but it did swing in the air either yes in that this sharp. This time he's bowling him and knocked him over. All around the shop. I think that Hassan was getting frustrated. Uh, he had he had up to that point faced 13 deliveries for his seven, and he swung to the heavens with that one. His head was in the air. Make sure they can now 2021. <laughs> this is whipped away for four. A lovely shot by Akbar. He's been in there long enough. Ah, it was a bit of a slog sweep through mid wicket down to the boundary for four. I, I, I like that one. <laughs> the offside, if he could have gotten that over them, he would have gotten runs. This is outside, and that is exactly what he does. On this occasion, they take one. That's good old Fazil Jahur has the gas to come back. Yes, he made it look easy. So, two. That's the first double we've seen in this tournament. And two, friendly so. It's going to be Fazl Jahur, and he is uh, facing up at the delivery. Just played a bit a bit wicked. There could be a run out. Fazl is out. Run out. He took off. He then stopped. Akbar was very, very intent on coming through for the run. And uh, that's a run out. So Fazil Yahoo goes run out. The score is now 37 for 4. But you know the interesting thing in that? 
coach would be very proud of him. He was run out when he was about halfway down the track. And he kept running to make sure he didn't make good his ground, but he made his ground. You know, we've seen certain things happen in cricket before, and it's possible that, you know, had he a commentary and taken a view at the TV, you're off today, enjoy your off day. You can put your feet up down the leg side. He's swinging this one. He's going to get some runs for it. He's going to get four, as a matter of fact. Beats the man who's running from the mid wicket region, and he could not put in the dive. So. Sad again goes in. He's going a well straight to the man in the covers and he's gone. A soft dismissal in the end. So Akbar, who's been there from the top of the inning, he has gone for 25 from 39. So the total is 44 for five. I don't want to welcome Mark, um, the the mayor of North Carolina in that region. Good to see you again, sir. Good to see you too. Thank you so much for inviting me up to the booth. Uh, what a gorgeous day we have here in Broward County. Of course, good to see you again. I'm going to turn it over to Vinod. He's going to take it away with you. All right. I'm Sarah Diva, and of course we have with us here Mark Stone, man. <laughs> it's the former mayor of Morrisville. What a lovely place, you know, I keep saying. It also has Mac TV that you can get live streaming. You can have a look at the cricket and do what we, we love best. Enjoy the beautiful game. And of course he has also lent his hand to Trinidad and Tobago. Uh, because of the fact that uh, in Trinidad and Tobago there's a match. Yeah, I was privileged to manage here on the 15 team in that classic. Um, did we win it? Yes, we did. Yes, not yeah, did. We, yeah. we just have to, <laughs> we just have to put that, that in there. Yeah, we, <laughs> we did in fact win it, but I think um, it was great to see that he came out, lent his sponsorship and his expertise to help on box. I, I wait to see if Mark would have uh, dove to take that. This time he's down the ground and this is out of here, is it? No, it's going to go back to him and he looked away. I don't think he's picking it up at all. He's, he's not picking it up apparently and there's no lights. It's, I don't know if it's the backdrop of the blue skies, but it's the second time he hasn't picked it up. Sammy hits it down the ground and the ball seems to be following this fielder and he oh, drops no. it. <laughs> I think it's safe to say he's not having the best day. He's not having the best of days today, but he but did run out yes. An excellent direct hit, not out, says the umpire. And Pakistan closed their innings at 82 for the loss of 9. Shazad, Shazan Ahmed, 14 not out. Masru, 7 not out. In fact, 5 not out. So it's 82 for 9. We'll quickly get the bowling figures. And uh, that's the scoreboard. Akbar Rana got 25. Your good friend Fazil Jahur from Trinidad Tobago. He didn't score. And the next player getting into double figures Shazan Ahmed 14 not out so just two players getting into double figures as well as extras uh, which total 11 and uh, the, the bowling Ritesh Patel the captain 4 overs 1 for 18 Rocky Singh 2 overs 1 for 8 Nicholas Sod 1 over none for 7 uh, Sanjay Pandya 2 for 14 or 4 uh, Lalta Prasad 2 for 14 or 4 as well Raju Jaswani 1 for 15 of 3 Junid Ahmed 1 for 5 of 2 very clinical bowling they are calling. Yeah, excellent uh, play by India and 82 for 9. It's going to be a total that's going to be really tough for Pakistan to defend. But who knows? It's going to, it's going to be really interesting. Well, we're back here and uh, the target is all of 83. In their stars, we'll be looking to get that. And Mark Stoneman. And there's so much that could be done for cricket here with guys like yourself. A lot of people like before he's out. And Dharmesh Patel, that looked pretty adjacent. Let me leave that one to Colin Board. Yeah, I think um, the ball started on, on leg and swung back across. Did it swing away far enough? I don't know. I think he, the, the shot itself, he was on one knee trying to paddle it. As a Here's Akram again. And this is hoiked away, a lovely shot. It's going to go a couple of bounces into the boundary for four at mid wicket. That delivery was actually swinging in the air. Swinging away from Rocky Singh, and somehow he was able to pull it over mid wicket. Now, Colin normally, conventionally, a batsman will realize that they have balls in hand and they just got to be patient. Sam Patel is bold all over the shop. Delivery pitched up. He was looking to go through the onside, and of course. As Ritesh Patel walks off, he rehearses the proper shot. That's yes. normally the case. Yeah, I think he looked beautiful after the fact. Um, he went played across the line. The ball is just pitched just about middle enough. 
coming into the left hander and rather than going straight i think he just went to, to play through the onside missed it completely was bold and he's now looking at playing the shot over in board will be replaced by the mayor of nevis ivor henry this is driven and he's dropped in and out of the hands of the captain azim and uh, colin has, uh, couldn't handle that one he, he is uh, stormed out of the of the com box yes rana some talks mm. away it's one could they go back for two yes they are so both players in there that's the second double we've seen it's for 12 for two i'm getting the impression that a lot depends on the rocky thing here this is four one bounce over the ropes a delivery in his zone and he was mindful of the fact that Midon was up in the circle and he was able to carry it away down to cow corner for four a very impressive shot That's exactly what he would have told me this is how we do it yeah. away from any one of those two feelers who are out past the 30 yard circle so he was in no man's land one bounce good shot picking his spot he spit the two This time he goes through the offside. More runs here for Rocky Singh. It's running away. It would not get to the boundary. And Mr. Singh comes back for two. It's now 18 for two. Now his, his intention is now he's away from the two fielders. Station outside of the 30-yard circle. He came up, up the edge, yes, but it was always going to be safe. Want to get it over the inner wing. lovely shot down the ground chase on ball versus man who would win the race ball ball so, so that's for us a lovely shot though brilliant straight drive just leaning into that one was Gitan patel proper cricketing shot sweetly time so almas he usually bowls his four overs on the trot so that will not deter him. Let's see the combat delivery. That's the way we do it. You're gonna hit those looping. Any one of the section outside the 30-yard boundary. I wish he goes for a four in the offside. You know, for the board, it's asking for your ID. Someone should ask for Patel's ID. <laughs> so pretty accomplished as well. Not a short man. The best batsman in the world, a short batsman. This is hoiked away down behind square and into the boundary for four. Some of the better batsmen in the world have seen. Let's start with Hanif Mohammed. He was a very short man. And uh, Brian Lara, of course, Sachin Tenduka. Ron Kanai, Don Bradman. Pretty short man. In St. Martin. And Mark has made significant investments across there. That's a good delivery. Coming back a bit pushed away on the offside so in may we then head across to st martin where we'll have the major cricket league in st martin involving 40, four teams and that is something to look forward to players from there will also be chosen and i think i may well take colin board with me to st martin it's a it's a lovely place i heard that he has a lot of connections there that's a wide a brilliant stop there by fazil jahu tremendously Able to go to this is cracked away down to the cover region that's one and we are looking for possible dates to move into st lucia the entire tournament that time you know was outside of covid so night riders would have played about two or three a lovely shot down the ground for four patel continues to impress here and that brings up the 15 the 10 to over 52 for three yes and to get to so i normally will follow the, the night riders to do my reports and comment it. i remember paying <laughs> thank yes. you very much thanks a lot for joining us there uh, colin so at the moment the score is uh, 52 this is punched away through the offside that's into the boundary for four takes patel to 25 and the score to 56 for three as i welcome the manager of the trinbago night riders colin board thank you uh kitan patel 21 of 29 looks a solid batsman very solid he's strong through the offside um, predominantly through the offside, but the key is that he has a lot of time. 
So we're back here. Thanks for staying with us. And that's a delivery that's worked around to short mid wicket. And a single. They're looking for two. No, it's not there. Very risky shot there from Mitra. He goes on to double figures now. As I welcome back on in board. But come to me. I'll see if I can help you out. I've got the medication for you. <laughs> this time, there's an appeal. Mitra was quick to see, uh, signal to the umpire that he had gotten back onto that. Let's wait to see from the official. My for Henry just reminded me that the New Zealand also brought Sri Lanka to play here. And uh, that was good as well. Pushed away on the offside. There's one more. I remember India coming here to play. And doing bracket C because of the slow nature of it. This time he's down the, the track. Pulls it away down to a cow corner area. And uh, they get to one. So that's one more to Mitra. He goes on to 30. You can't underestimate <laughs> Stroll in the park. <laughs> Literally. Broward, Broward Park. Early in the first inning. I was wondering what in the second inning. Here it is again. The batsmen they're preserving their wickets for that matter. If you're right. Yeah, yeah. You know, that ball could have been hit out of the park, but he just covered up nicely, and uh, the wages are still up. I think on a straight I think it's, boundary. I think it's this one. This over. This this over. Okay. He's trying. He's, He's trying. trying. Let's see. Oh, he got it. He got there it. You go. Yes. <laughs> there you go. He got it with a boundary. Finally. <laughs> So that's Mitra. He is not out on. Are we seeing 15? No, it should be yeah, 20, no, six, 16 to 29. 16, 29. So players are just kind of going by feel out there. They don't. They don't have uh, headsets on or anything. Or a, 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 a but live scoreboard. But the way you call it. Yeah. There you go. Well, it's been a pleasure. Thank you so much for having me in the booth for this. And uh, I might be back for the USA uh, West Indies. I'm going to sit out this first match to gear up for the next two on Tuesday and Wednesday. So I um, look forward to being back here. Thank you, sir.